What's going on guys? So, this is the video I was promising you guys. This is on the gargoyle bosses. So, uh, before I get into this, Dark coded this. This is all him. Props to him. Um, it's pretty It's pretty good. I like it. And the drops are, are pretty good as well. Let me show those right now. Um, so this will be a very rare right here. This will be a very rare. This will be a very rare. And then obviously the pet will be very rare, but... As you can see, there's a lot of good things here. Mr. Buses, Crystal Keys, um, uh, the Granite Dust is worth 10k each. So each kill, you're you're guaranteed a one in one mil chance. You know, like one 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 through one mil GP, um, and that's really gonna add up. You know, it doesn't sound like that much right off the back, but if you're killing a bunch of these, um, then that's pretty good. And then this right here is gonna have uh, it's gonna be pretty interesting. Basically, it is going to be kind of an average weapon. You wouldn't really use it, but it's going to have a real big damage boost against the Slayer bosses. The uh, Gargoyles, um, Cerberus, Sire, those ones. The, the ones that are uh, like a superior version or whatever you want to call them. Uh, so that should be cool. Uh, the boots, the Guardian boots, will be best in slot. And then the, the Jar of Stone will be for donator points. So that should be cool as well. Uh, so let's get into this. All right. So in terms of setup, you're you're probably gonna you're gonna use melee, and you're gonna want your best crush. Uh, so obviously you want Elder Maul, you want the uh, Dragon Warhammer, the Zamraki and Hasta, the feel like I'm forgetting. Is it Bludgeon? Bludgeon. There's the other one. Uh, and uh, let me uh, show you how it goes. So I don't want to show everything, but I will show enough just to show you a little bit of you know how it works. One not you know what's the what's the point of a show off video if we don't show off much, right? Uh, so you get this little thing, and that will let you enter it. Now, I'm not going to be... Uh, they don't have any damage coded, so you're not going to really have a good uh, grasp on how much <laughs> damage they do. Uh, so we're just going to do a nice little chill. I don't want to give you I don't wanna give you too much, but... Uh, so you see we have this one right here, and right now everything is normal. Now, uh, these stats for him are, 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 are the correct stats. So as you can see, I'm hitting pretty good with a Hasta, or if we switch to this... We should hit pretty good as well. Let's repot up. And, you know, this is max gear on a Slayer task. You can't get a, a boss task for it. Um, and you should do you should do, you should should do do well in, with Crush. Um, if you try Rapier or something like that, I just don't think you'll have um, much success. So as you can see, so far, it's not too tough. Um, but one thing <laughs> that I guess that is an issue where like you can sometimes sometimes she just kind of like hides in the corner. We have Don over here, so Don is the uh, counterpart. And again, like once they have damage, this you you'll be a lot more aware of her. Trust me, you'll be way more aware of of, of her shenanigans. Uh, so you can continue t on with Dusk, or you can kill her. Um, I'll show you one more mechanic, and I'll let you make that decision for yourself. But uh, so as of right now, you continue on in the fight. There are these gargoyles here as well. So uh, minions can spawn. And if there gets to a point where there are too many minions, you'll get this message right here. So, and uh, basically what that's telling you is that damage right there, you just took that damage. Um, so basically all the minions are giving Dawn strength, and uh, that's you're just going to randomly start taking these really big hits. So you definitely don't want to have more than three ever at one point. Um, and then you're sitting here with uh, Dusk. I, know, I was talking to my brother, so I kind of missed it. But uh, basically, whenever he gets to below 50 health, she will sacrifice herself and heal him back up. So whether you want to kill her first or not, it's your call. Now keep in mind that the Dusk is more of a tank, and the Dawn is more of an, an offensive one. So we'll finish this kill right here. All in all, not too bad if you're not taking any damage whatsoever, right? Nice and easy. Switch back to that. It's probably a little bit faster. I, I don't know if Dragon Warhammer would be better. I just assumed Hasta was would uh, really. I just had a Hasta in my inventory, and I didn't. I didn't want to figure out the ID for Dragon Warhammer and spawn it. And there we go. And Super Catmats, our first kill. That's probably the worst drop, but let's see how much dust we got. Slayer's 770k, so that's not bad. So yeah, that is the Gargoyle boss. Now, uh, there's still a couple things left to do, you know, to work on, but it's not completely done. Hopefully that uh, this update will be out soon. Again, I'm not going to give out any dates just because yeah, that hasn't worked out for us, so 
we'll, uh, we'll stray away from that. Uh, but yeah, that'll be the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, in terms of the next updates after this, we have the uh, Rev Cave we're going to work on. And then we also have the all the new Dragon, uh, Dragon Slayer 2 stuff, so that should be pretty cool.